told me he did 10,000 trips in six years. I did 5,000 in less than one year. Uh, it must have been 100,000 maybe. Somebody right here. 
you know, or that the po-po. Hello. Hello. I'm trying to see if that's the, the motorcycle that got me before. <laughs> but he was, no, he, he was sheriff. He, he was sheriff. He, he dropped off my food one time. Yes. Oh, really? The 713. Yes, sir. You missed him? Yes, sir. <laughs> me too. Uh, you got the pen so I can get I'm this show on the road? The 2106. <laughs> yeah, man, my transmission went out of my car, so I got I to gotta hustle and bustle on this. And it's a, this is this is a almost a four hundred dollars a week. Oh my gosh! But I'm I'm already crunching. It's a, I, I, I'm taking it as a blessing in disguise because um in my, in my car I put if I work every day because I try to work every day unless something's wrong with my car and uh, I put like seventy bucks of gas a day mm. and seventy times thirty is twenty one hundred. Shit, I could buy me one of these motherfuckers with the gas money. <laughs> so, a, br a brand new one, you know. But but I don't I don't want one like this. That the, the, all the other guys are putting me on game. Like at the charging station, they're telling me because yeah. I, I see them what they're putting up in, and they're like, <laughs> one was like, uh, yeah, man, I make like five hundred dollars a day in this car. I'm like, most shit. Right. So uh, so they're they're. He told me he bought it for twenty four thousand. It's um it's a Kia. Uh, is it an LV6 or some shit like that? And uh, and I seen the other other guys pulling up in the in the. They said they rent them. They, they said they're renting that one cheaper than I'm renting this one. I'm like, what? They said, oh yeah, he's hitting you for the insurance and everything. I said, mm -hmm. I don't know, man. Four hundred dollars. I'm just I just got to make it work, man. But then I had a problem because I guess I was fucking with this right here. And something somehow, you know, it's looking like a paddle shift. I was yeah. fucking with it, like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> and then I was fucking with this. It it reduces the amount of charge I'm allowing it to take. Oh, okay. So I'm there, like, oh, it's only taking one cent, and then it's not charging at all. And I'm calling the the, the place where I'm charging it at. They say they're they're running a test on the charger. And he said it's not the charger. And he said, you sure you got money on your card? And I'm like, yeah, but let me make sure just in case somebody got me. Mm -hmm. And I said, yeah, I got money on the card. Then I said it must be the car. So when I went back, because I didn't, I didn't, I only worked uh, Thursday and all, only made like forty bucks delivery, and it was late at night. It's trash, you know. And so with this, I, I I've been up since well yesterday, but started delivering at eight o'clock at night or evening because it wasn't even night yet. But from eight to ten, it was super slow. But I already. I gotta come out at four o'clock in the morning when everybody's going to work. Yeah, well, I have, have a, I don't know if you still have, I got a different card now. Oh, right there. Yeah, so I follow your page already. Oh, you do? Yeah, yeah. Man, man, he's, man, I've been having some wild shit happen to me, man, so. You know, and I was talking to some driver, he's been doing it for a while. He said he hasn't got any, any near wrecks or anything. Like somebody tried to fucking crash it to me a, a, a little over a month ago, and, and I seen him. I, I'm not an angel. I'm not an angel. And if you cut me off, it's gonna piss me off. Like your time is not more important yeah. than mine. Why didn't you get behind me? And uh, I got on the side of the star. Beep beep. They didn't want to look. And <laughs> and, and that's how they be. They act all mad. Yeah. Full of mix and they're like. Yeah. Now now they act like. Oh, I didn't do nothing wrong. But all you have to do is say, I'm sorry, man. But it escalated and the motherfucker tried to fucking clip me and shit and I move, I move because I seen him coming, I hear the raggedy ass car because I had my windows down and uh because it was cool at night and because it had, I think it has rained that yeah. that day and then he was getting right on my corner. I'm like, I'm, I move like this in front of me. He started spinning in front of me, started going backwards, then hit a fence, going backwards, jumped the curb and so I put that video out there, right? And, and people started talking shit to me. You know, they don't understand. You, yeah. The more you talk shit to me, the more I talk back, the more people are gonna see it. Yeah. So 
they're doing me a favor. Yeah, boosting your post. T talking about I shouldn't have a license. They're gonna call San Antonio police on me. I said, do what you're gonna do, man. They're the ones who, who, because they're trying to say I did a hit and run. I'm like, I didn't even hit nobody. What are you talking about? They're not paying attention because um, they think I, I drowned them like this, but yeah. he tried to hit me. They think I try to. They're not paying attention. Man. Like, if you're paying attention, you can see that I switched lanes. Yeah. But man, the people are talking. And then even when I I got pulled over by Castle Hills, and uh, I heard there are fucking their assholes people telling me I don't fucking. San Antonio, so I don't know, you know. Yeah. I, just, I, just moved, yeah. I just moved to San Antonio forever. So I, I showed him the video where I almost got T-boned because that 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 picture right there yeah. is from that. All I don't right. know if you can see that the light, my light's green and I was yeah. going, and then a truck right there on the uh, on Petranco and 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 Bella Vista. So every time I pass by there, so that could have been me right there, and uh, they they saying that. I'm causing their insurance rates to go up. I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? They're they're, they're mad. I'm going 15 over. What's what's so big about that? You know, I'm not fucking going 100 miles drag racing a Hellcat and shit. And they, they talk shit. I'm like, you can say whatever you want. I don't give a fuck. We're gonna call the police on you. Call them. <laughs> they're not gonna even. They, they didn't even try to stop the street takeover that's down the street from them. How are they gonna fuck with me? Do what you do. I don't care. We're gonna try to get you kicked off of Uber and this and that. I don't. I'm making them too much money, bro. Then because yeah, he just told me I, I've, I've been delivering. That's all I've been doing is <coughs> delivering. But these these past two days, I've I've been uh, dropping the people off, making a little bit more money off that. Yeah, but it's more constant. Yeah. I don't have to sit here waiting like, oh, yeah. let me get a ten dollar one. But but I gotta get my acceptance rate up because it was like at twenty percent. Yeah. Because I only I only pick like ten dollars, ten miles. Yeah. Like like that's my gauge right there, and so my, my acceptance rate was twenty percent. I gotta get it up to like eighty five percent. So I'm taking everything. I'm taking everything, and it doesn't matter if it's three dollars. I'm taking it. If it's ten dollars, I'm taking it. If it's a way out to Bernie, I'm taking it. And I'm I'm just gonna I, I gotta build it up, you know. Because the, the higher you get, the better prices, the, the better offers you're gonna get. And then the electric car too, and but it's this is not the right electric car. But that's the only car they had because I wanted to rent a ga uh, gas car because that's what I'm used to and shit. And so man, it takes a fucking hour to charge this bitch. Man. But there, I'm just sitting there chopping up with the other persons. That, <laughs> but they're putting me on game though. Yeah. They're putting me. The other dude I was talking to. Not last night, the night before, told me he makes one hundred and sixty thousand a year. Do it still be? Yep. I know. But he has two cars. Yeah. He does the Uber, and has it's the Uber Black. It's the premium. <laughs> yeah. It's a black car with black leather. I think an N ten. I think they charge like thirteen times as much mm -hmm. than the the Uber X. So if you get like a five dollar ride, it's fucking what thirteen fifty eighty five. So he's getting like a hundred hundred dollar licks. Like he he don't have to tell me that shit. But he said, well, it doesn't matter. Whatever you do doesn't affect me anyway. So I'll I'll, I'll help you out. And tell me I'm like so right here. Y'all just pick up your car. What? Better pick up a U haul. U haul. Uh, are y'all moving again or what? Yeah. Actually, I want to move back to the H, man. Okay. I need to get a whole bunch of shit settled. What part of Ace are you from? Farm Clark. Oh, right on. That's where my daddy's from. No from shit. Hell yeah. I appreciate it. I mean, yes, sir. Y'all have a good one. Yep, sure. She he remember me, and I didn't even remember him. I usually have that great elephant memory, but... <coughs> I'm 
See where it's, where it's hot at? The block is hot at nowhere. Let me take this right though. Because I've been in this little section for a minute. It's all good. Go with the hoodies in. One of my subs, that's cool as hell, man. Pressing on my phone, I'm even pressing on the, <coughs> the other part of my finger must have touched the lower part.
shot down a ten dollar one to get a three dollar one. Come on. So that's not the way you do it, man. Like, unless you communicate it with that other person, man. Unless they did. <coughs> Come on, man. Fuck. You made me get a fucking ticket and shit.
Be careful, man. Be careful. Yeah, it has it has your weight over here. That's why I was looking. You didn't see me was looking. Like, uh, yeah. It has, like the by the gas station yeah, or something. Yeah, the gas station addressing, but then when I get the notice, they said it was going to be by the Taco. I don't know. I better walk over to the Taco. <laughs> All right. Well, we connected. Yeah, I don't need to, uh, but I need to go closer over there to the set. Some people are courteous. Most people aren't, you know. <laughs> but I'm recording uh, for our safety inside and out. Okay, sure. But my, my, phone, my phone has the... Oh, yeah. Can I even go through there? No, well, you make a right. You yeah, but I got to... Here you go. Okay. No, but I had to get closer to the place where I need to pick you up to accept it. Okay, I'll just set the domino. You do your job. Okay. <laughs> Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I'm trying to I'm trying not to, cause uh, I, I I deliver, but now I'm I'm dropping the people. I've, I've been delivering for ten months, and, and uh, my transmission is going out of my car, so I had to rent a car, and it's it's like three hundred and eighty, almost four hundred bucks, and the, the guy, I guess, the, using this car is a little bit different, cause I'm. It takes an hour to charge up, and it only gives you like a little over 200 miles. Oh. When I can put gas in my car, you know, it only takes like five minutes to fill it up or 10 minutes, and it, and I get 300 and something miles. Uh -huh. But uh, since I'm doing this, I got to, I got to pick the people up, man. And yeah. It's, I don't know, I'm, I'm a people person, but you came to get everybody on a good day, you know. But so far, I haven't had any problems. Yeah. This is only my second full day. Oh, okay. I was uh, going to take the bus, and then I looked up the, the bus schedule. Oh, yeah. Like, oh, my God. I have to, over an hour, and I'm like, okay, and it's too bad to walk. So, yeah, wow, the, the, bus is, the bus is, the bus sucks. Yeah, yeah. They call it the Bandera Frequent. I'm like, yeah, it's frequent. Yeah, <laughs> when it's frequent, wait, it doesn't, it's, have to wait an hour. doesn't it, doesn't it supposed to come every 15? Well, it's <coughs> Time is precious. I'm trying to take every one, every one, so I can uh, get a higher acceptance rate, so I can get uh, better offers. And, yeah. but, I, but, when, but when I deliver the food, my acceptance rate was 20%. Because I'm only taking certain ones, but but on this, I got to I gotta make something work, so. Are you going to the car dealership? Yes, uh-huh, yeah. I delivered over here a few times. Uh -huh. And those people do not know to drive those chargers, man. They crash everywhere and crash at the people everywhere. your day. Oh, thank you. So <laughs> You're welcome. Right, right. Oh, Ooh. about to get that car, that door knocked off. <laughs> that Whose fault would it have been? Yeah, right. Yeah. It would have been my right, fault or his right fault? Here. I, I get out here. Whose fault would it have been if I would have knocked the door off? I know, right? It would have been my fault or his Oh, thank, thank you, ma'am. Appreciate you. Oh. That helped put some electricity in the car. Yeah, because <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah, it only right, takes right. about 10 bucks to fill it up. Yeah, but it takes an hour. <laughs> Say bye.
Is it, is it hard to go the speed limit in that bike? Yeah. Is it hard to go the speed limit on the bike? Yeah. <laughs> you got the bunny rabbit ears on. Huh?
today. All right, how about yourself, sir? Yeah, doing pretty good. I'm Busy driving. today? Yeah, I'm driving this little electric car in a... <laughs> My transmission's going out in my car, so and I, I needed to rent a car. I wanted a gas car, but this is all they have. And the, and the other Uber drivers that are uh, talking to when I go to charge it up are telling me I got the wrong kind of car. I said, man, it's the only car they have, man. <laughs> but, I want a guy. Huh? Yeah, they're so they're because uh, I spend like seventy bucks on gas a day. But I'm doing the whole, the whole twelve. Yeah. But then I, when I was, but I was delivering. This is my spot right here. Yeah. In the, the H&B parking lot. And, but um, now, I'm, cause I, I told my my homeboy, my barber, he, he he's right there. I was gonna go chop it up with him. Cause I only got like thirty minutes left. But and uh, I was talking to him, and I tell him, man, maybe it's a blessing in disguise, man. Now, I needed to get a new transmission, of course, but I'm talking to those people, man. One dude I talked to, not last night, or should I say this morning, yesterday morning, told me he makes a hundred, he made 160,000 last year. But he, he, and he said he's all, he takes Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday off. But he, he doesn't, he, he told me that the car that he has, it's a Kia. He knows. He's told me the BMW makes the car. Yeah. Well, the engineers from BMW left from over there to make that car. It's an SUV. I think it's a CV6 or something. LV6, something like that. Yeah. And I looked it up. Cause he told me he bought it for like twenty-two thousand on Car Carvana, but it's it's forty-two brand new. He said it only had like twelve thousand miles on it. And uh, is it electric too? Yeah, it's electric. But it charges up. The, the, this car takes an hour to charge up. That car takes and 18. How, how, how long, how far can you go? Uh, like 220 something. Because it, it takes from, from zero to 80. It takes the same amount of time as from 80 to 100. Really? So they say it's charge it to 100. But last night I was over there talking to another driver, so... I charge it over to little to, than than eighty percent, but and it, it only cost me ten dollars. But I pulled up with like um, thirty something, because if, if if I get stranded somewhere, they're, they're, they're not gonna rent me another car. They're not gonna rent me another car, so I gotta be aware of the mileage and how much it takes me to go to the charging station, and I gotta make sure the charging station works ahead of time, because some of these motherfuckers don't. Cause I, I'll put it up to the one at Target and the uh, Bandera in yeah, 1604. Yeah. It, it doesn't work. But I had like 70 miles, you know, so. Yeah. So I, I went to my regular spot, my, and, which is the Target. The Target on uh, I-10 and 14. And they're telling me, man, they're, you're, what you would, would you pay for to rent that car? You could have rent one of these. That's what they were telling me last night. And. I said, yeah, I ran it through Avis. He said, yeah, you need to go through Hertz. I need to go through Hertz. and Because th th that one, it charges up in 18 minutes, and it's 325 miles. Really? Yeah, and, and you get better, you get better, um, you get better offers. Like like right now, because yeah. I'm, when I'm delivery driving, and, um, because I would make about 1500 give or take. You know, and then I started taking like one day off, and I still make close to fifteen hundred. But hey, keep in mind that I put seventy dollars in gas every day. Yeah, no kid. But when tax time rolls around, and I, I put, say I make five thousand, right? I put about five thousand miles on my car, and when tax time rolls around, they're gonna give me tax credit, tax deductible, seventy cents per mile. Yeah. So that's thirty five hundred. Off of five thousand, and my tax rate, I'm, I'm like twenty five percent, cause I claim zero and have no dependents. And so I'm thinking, cause I was asking, I say, hey man, when you get all that money back uh, at the end of the year, you get all that money back. Like, uh, so if I'm getting five thousand plus, and and shit, 
I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be robbing these motherfuckers in the yeah. end, you know. Yeah. But but my my realization is that I give me electric car like they're talking about, and I can make way more money and put more miles and run that motherfucker to the ground if I want, I guess. Cause, I, but I'm, I try not to jump over curbs, but it happens sometimes. Not in this little car. This little car is like a go kart so. <laughs> Yeah, so like I like like I told my boss, man, it's a blessing in disguise. And then he he told me, he says, man, you want to get an electric car? And he said, man, I I got a, he's a barber, so he barbers know thousands of people. Oh, yeah. And he's like, he said, man, I'll talk to one of my friends. He's a he's a, a financial supervisor at some dealership or something. I'm like, I hope it's a Kia dealership because it's a Kia. It's a Kia. And he said, man, we, we try, he said, I'm going to see if I can talk him in to get you something with, with nothing down. I'm like, he said, whichever way it goes, I'm thinking I'm at least slap a thousand on it, try to pay it off sooner. Because um, I don't like to have the notes and the longer you run it, the long, the more expensive it is. Yeah, and... yeah but the, 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 they're telling me, man, get rip that car and this car. They're, they're making a killing, man, like $500 a day. And they choose when to take off, you know. Yeah, yeah. There's money, but you got to put the legwork. You and, got you you get more money driving electric, right? Yeah. Well, the offers are better, and um, I don't know. I really, I'm just doing Uber X. Yeah. They're doing all kind of like almost the whole board, like, and uh, one guy was telling me that he he does Uber Black premium or some shit like that and I looked it up and it's, it's a it's a black luxury vehicle with a with leather interior and it it's like 13 times the rate as, yeah. as this right here so like if, if the if it's five dollars comes out to be like eighty five dollars on the on the right you know, for the more professional people that I guess don't want to hop out of a little car like this, they would rather get out of an Escalade or a Tahoe or something like that. Yeah, but but since I've been uh, delivery driving and I got, oh, that's what I forgot to say. I'm recording for the outside and the inside because I got this uh this Ultra, this yeah. is the Ultra 23, that's the 24, and uh, because truthfully, you need to at least video what's happening in front of you because um. Uh, probably about a little over a month ago. Matter of fact, the day that Donald Trump got shot, yeah, uh, I had a collision with the youngster, and then I blew the horn. I already seen; I could see it coming. I blew the horn, the preemptive honk, and then he hit me. Then he honks. So I was like, then we pulled into the neighborhood on Sheffield, and I don't one of those streets like after the, that junior high, or whatever it is. And, I said, I said, man, you hit me, bro. And I had food. I had two orders in the car. And it was like close to like 30 bucks. I was like, damn, man, I'm not going to even get the 30 bucks. And, but I'm pissed off about my car. And I said, man, you hit me, bro. Nah, you hit me. I said, nah, man, you can't pull that. I said, I, I said I'm, I'm, I'm recording it. He said, well, let me see it. I said, man, I ain't letting you see shit. For what? Go ahead and lie to your insurance. When they're going to see my footage, you know, like, come on, bro. It's, you got to be gotta have some integrity in your life you know because yeah. i i hit someone by accident on by on i was on 151 by west over hills and i didn't even see her i'm getting over and I, I barely kissed her right and i was like i said pull over we can't pull over right here because it's dangerous on 151 it's it's so we pulled over like uh getting off to 1604 and there's some apartments right there and i told her i said I, i'm not gonna lie to you it's my fault when the policeman comes i'm gonna tell him it's my fault you know, because I, I got to live myself at the end of the day. Right. But not everybody's like that. So. Yeah. yeah, so I've been uh, uh, delivery driving, and I'm trying to show the people how to make the money. Ain't nobody really responds back. But here's my YouTube channel. Right. I only have like 200-something subs. But, um, yeah, there's some there's some crazy clips on there. Somebody tried to wreck me. I got pulled over by Castle Hills, and they let me go. Castle Hills doesn't let anybody go, huh? Yeah, so it was much. <laughs> yeah, but I was on the freeway. Oh yeah, I was on the freeway and uh, four ten going going that way, and and I'm, I'm going eighty and a sixty five, and cars are I feel like going faster than me. And 
I seen them lights. I was like, damn, man. And I pulled over and I could have got T-boned in that picture right there if you if you if you study the picture. And uh, that's why I made that 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 card like that. Yeah. And I, I showed him the clip. I showed him the clip and I think he had leniency on me. He didn't give me give me the ticket. He said, I'm just gonna give you a warning. I'm I'm gonna use all, all the bullets in my gun, so to speak. So I'm gonna try to get out this ticket. And so I'm gonna do it to him every time. And this is the thing, like when I get pulled over, it's usually on the freeway or something. They're coming from behind me, so I don't see them. And, um, you know, I don't want to. They're going to tell you don't pull over on the highway. And I'm not going to pull over on the access road. I pull over the first chance I get. And, and only one time they got mad at me. Uh, I guess he got mad, but I'm doing it for your safety. I'm not trying to evade you, bro. Yeah. Like, you know, you see me slow down and all this. And, you know, I. I, I Load the windows on my car. Try to cut the lights on because I don't want them to be surprised about anything, and I don't want them to shoot me for nothing, you know, because they could get away with it. And I don't even think that car was supposed to turn. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Yeah. So that, that's what I told him. I said, uh, I said, uh, sir, I hope you don't mind. I pull over right here. It took me a little while to pull over because if if you get hit, I'm gonna have to save you, sir. So that's just the humanity in me. That's that's my line right there. That's right. But because I, that's I don't care if he gave me a, a ticket or if he was supposed to take me to jail. I'm gonna have to save this man's life, man. Because uh, that's just the right thing to do as a as a human, you know. Just like if he was to shoot me, hopefully he would try to give, put the tourniquet or something on me, you know. <laughs> save you. Right? Yeah. <laughs> After he doesn't try to kill me, but but I already know don't make any sudden movements and you know, because I'm 51 years old and. I'm from the hood in H Town, so I already kind of know like what to keep my hands on the wheel. And yes, sir, no, sir. I show them respect. They show me respect back. And I'm not for this to just try to escalate anything because I have nothing to, to win. Yeah, so, uh, you know, that's a hard job they do, man. And, you know, I, I respect the badge, but, you know, it, it, this is the thing I can't respect about officers. You need to turn in the bad ones, man. Instead of being the blue wall of silence or the blue shield or whatever, if you don't turn off, if you don't turn on the bad ones, you're just as guilty as them. But they don't think like that. But they're because but if you do turn on them and you're trying to report when something happens and you need their help, they're not going to come and help you. So they're going to leave you to die. And so they gotta for your life. You gotta you know go with the program. And at the, at the end of the day, you gotta live with yourself. That's how I feel. At the end of the day, you gotta right. but everybody doesn't feel like that. So, no, unfortunately, they don't. Yeah. I don't know. Everybody thinks different, but I, you know, I, I have to live with myself. So, I don't want to do shit that I shouldn't be doing. Feel guilty about it later for the rest of my life or something. Mm -hmm. Even if it's small, you know. They're not on you. Yeah, because. I like to think I'm a great person. Don't bring the devil out, though. Because <laughs> everybody everybody could, could get a little crazy. and But it just it takes this certain circumstance. Like if you're fucking with their family or something like that, you know. But if they're fucking with your family, too, come on now, man. You should think about that, too. If you're messing with somebody, like the cops, when they kill somebody, they're not thinking that their cousin or brother is going to come back and kill any of their family. But it happens. A while back, judges were getting killed, man. And, uh, they, you know, they, I guess they felt betrayed or something. But, hey, man, they, you already know if you do that, that's the rest of you. It's, it's game over for you. But they're already ready to go on suicide by cops. So their mind frame is not right. But when when your loved one dies or gets killed, it it's hard to get over that, man. And especially if, if they're not in the wrong, man. But who knows, you know, like now the, the video cameras tell it on. Yeah, that's a good part of it. Yeah. Right? Appreciate you, sir. Have a good one. You too. You have a great day. Thank you.
Yeah, there's good people in this world, dude. We lose faith in humanity. At the end of the day, everybody's trying to go home. Tortuga.
tortuga. Want a train? <laughs> the C8 for the for the boat. He started laughing. Well, go ahead, sir. Go ahead.
ahead, sir. Go ahead. I only got one drop left. It's already at an hour and something. 